Hello everyone! Welcome to our tutorial on how to showcase the latest and most viewed content on your website using Elementskit's blog posts widget. In this video, we'll provide you with a step-by-step -step guide to set up and customize the widget. So let's dive right in. To begin, log into your website's admin dashboard and navigate to the Elementskit widget area. Locate the blog posts option and enable it by ticking the toggle next to it. Don't forget to save your changes by clicking the Save Changes button. Next, let's create a new page where we'll display our blog posts. Click on the Add New option under Pages. This will take you to a new page. Give it a title and click the Edit with Elementor button to access the Elementor Editor. In the Elementor Editor, use the widget search bar to find the Blog Posts widget. Drag and drop it onto your page by clicking on the plus icon. It's time to customize the layout of our blog posts. Adjust the layout style, enable or disable the carousel. Set the feature image position and size. Customize the title, content, and read more options. Take your time to fine tune the settings according to your preferences. Now let's configure the query options for the blog posts widget. Enter the desired post count. Select the specific posts you want to display by using the Search and Select field. Adjust the offset, order by, and order according to your needs. In the Metadata tab, customize the display of floating date and category, as well as the metadata itself. You can also edit the meta position, author image, and date icon to match your website's style. Now let's configure the carousel settings. Customize the space between slides, slides to show, slides to scroll, speed, autoplay, pagination, and arrow options. This allows you to create a dynamic and engaging display of your blog posts. It's time to make our blog posts widget visually appealing. In the Style tab, you can edit the background type, box shadow, container border radius, padding, and margin. Similarly, customize the style of the container border, content border, featured image, meta, floating category, title, content, author image, and pagination to match your website's design. You can customize pagination by adjusting its horizontal and vertical position, size, border radius, active color, active size, and border type. These modifications allow you to personalize the appearance and placement of pagination elements, creating a tailored design that seamlessly integrates with your website. You've customized your blog posts widget. Before we wrap up, double check all your settings and styling. Once you're satisfied, click the update button to make your blog posts live on your website. You're all set to showcase your latest and popular content using Elementskit's blog posts widget. Now you have the knowledge to beautifully display your blog posts using Elementskit's blog posts widget. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more useful tutorials. Thank you for watching.